Now in Google Docs, any user with can comment access to a document will be able to make suggested edits to the document. The suggested edits will appear in the document along with the comment explaining the edit. Those with can edit permission will be able to accept or reject those suggested edits. Those with can view access will not be able to see suggested edits until they are accepted. Viewers will also no longer be able to see regular comments, which is a change from today. To demonstrate some of these items, let's go ahead and go to my Shared With Me, and let's go into one of our documents here at the top. So to begin, I'd like to go into a document that has been shared with me and given me all different privileges, just to show you what it's going to look like from each side. So the first one we're going to go into is a document that I have editing privileges in. If I open this document, the newest feature that you're going to see enabled is in the upper right hand corner. Just as before, I'll be able to edit the document as if I'm working on it myself. Now in the upper right hand corner, you'll notice this new button where it says editing. If I go ahead and click this, you'll notice that I can go into a couple of different modes here. I can go editing mode, which allows me to edit the document directly. Or I can go into suggested mode, meaning I can make changes to this document and the actual owner of the document will be able to approve those changes or not. And then I can go into viewing or print mode, which I can see what the final copy is going to be like, as well as not being able to edit it. So if you have been given the ability to either edit a document or comment on a document, you'll be able to use this suggested mode. If I click on this, you'll notice the button turns gray at the top, and now I can come into my text document, and I'll just make a quick change. I'll do example suggestion. You'll notice it pulls out my comment box out to the right side, and I can make another question added to this. As an editor or owner of a document, you'll be able to approve or reject any changes that have been made. You'll notice in the top here there is a box with a check in it and a box with an X. I can either reject the suggestion, in this case it would automatically clear off anything that I've made as a change, or I can accept the suggestion and it would keep the change and add that to the document. So you'll notice if I just click on the check mark, it's just added that change to the document. Now what I'd like to do is go back to my shared drive and let's open up the next item here which is comment. So now this is a document where I only have commenting privileges. So now what I can do is go into this document. Maybe I can make some, some changes. Maybe I can make some changes. But you'll notice that when I come into the document I have suggesting already highlighted here in the upper right hand corner. If I go to that same box and pull down you'll notice that as a commenter I do not have the privilege to edit something. I can make suggested edits, but they would have to be approved by an editor. So now let's go ahead and add another change. Just as in before when I was an editor, it brings out a box to the right side here. It gives me the comment option. Shall we add this? And then you'll notice in the top right corner, being that I am not an editor, I do not have the power to go ahead and make this as an accepted change. So I'll just click on reply. You'll also notice that when we are in suggesting mode, it highlights with a green line any change that I have made or underlined here with the green. So this is what it looks like when you only have comment only privilege. Now lastly, let's go back to my shared with me, and let's go into a view only. When I'm in the view only mode, you'll notice that my toolbar is gone, just as in the regular view only mode, but then also in the upper right hand corner, I do not have the power to make any suggested comments. I cannot insert any comments at all. Another thing you'll notice is that viewers will also no longer be able to see regular comments, which is a change from today. The last thing I'd like to show you is what it's going to look like on your end if you're the owner of a document and have shared something out and given those shared permissions. I'm just going to go to my other monitor here and I'm going to drag in one of the documents that we had and drag that into my screen just to show you what it looks like. This is the one that had editing privileges 
you'll notice that the edit was automatically added here and saved. Going back to my other screen, I'm just going to drag in my other document. Here's what the next document looks like. You'll see that here is the suggested change in pink. This was the comment only. They did not have the power to add that. So now I can come over here to this comment, see the change that someone made, click on that comment, it will highlight the area that was changed, and I can accept or reject those changes. And lastly, let's go to my other screen and just drag my other viewing document here. This is the one that had view only privileges. You'll notice I made a comment here, and that in the previous version, the viewer was not able to see this comment. So now if I go ahead and close these other documents out, here we are back in my view only, and you'll notice that the viewer cannot see that comment that was made. So going back to my very first document here, just to reiterate, up in the upper right hand corner, you'll notice that you have an editing, suggesting, and viewing mode that you can now enable in your Google Docs.